on the internet. It is Friday. We are actually off to work, which is weird. We don't usually go to work together, but I've got a conference in the city today, and Octavius is just here as normal. So it's kind of early, so I'm still sleepy. Um, but we're going to a really scary escape room this evening, so I thought maybe this would be a good day to vlog. And also, I just felt like vlogging, so yeah. Okay, so we are on the way home now. We just finished Annabelle um, at Lost in Melbourne. So the last part I vlogged was us going in and then I had to stop vlogging because if you guys have done escape rooms before, generally they don't like people having phones or cameras or anything. They don't really want you to give away what the room is like. So I won't give away like all the details of the room obviously, but um, the unique thing about Annabelle is that it's a horror escape room. So, um, like most escape rooms, is just a lot of puzzles and they'll give you a storyline and that sort of stuff. And um, in some previous vlogs, you would have seen that we've done some that, you know, weren't so great. This one was actually really, really good. Um, if you were actually, if you're really, really adverse to experiencing horror, then I probably wouldn't recommend it for you because it does have quite a few jump scares and um, stuff like that. But Everything is woven in really well, I would say. Do you think so? Yeah, it was, it was yeah. well put together. It was like, really it was, well. It was like a theme and environment and atmosphere. Yeah, and, and everything kind of made that. cohesive sense. Like, one of the last escape rooms that we did, it, it just didn't make sense because we were like solving puzzles ahead of when they were supposed to come up in the sequence. Yeah, it, it didn't line, it didn't sequence well. No, it was really bad. This one was actually really good. And apparently they've got two others, um, Before Midnight and a zombie one. I don't know if we'll go back for them. Um, if we do, it would probably be with the same group of friends. Um, I'm not even sure if Violet and Jimmy would not enjoy this sort of escape room. Yeah, I don't, yeah. I, I don't know whether Violet would enjoy it much. Yeah, I don't know. My friend and I were like holding each other the whole time. Because it was just one part that it's just so typical of a horror movie that like something happened in there. And I was like, this is like a real life horror movie. Hold me. <laughs> um, but I'm really glad I did it. And we finished it, which was good too. So yeah, I'm gonna go home and just kind of debrief on the day, I think. So Tobias is refueling the car at the moment, so I thought I would just sit here and chat oh, and just kind of admire the angle of the camera. It's actually quite wide. Um, I have Pokemon Go on at the moment. Um, yeah, maybe this is a good time to chat for a little bit, for a few minutes at least. Um, but so. The conference today at work, I don't, I don't think I got a chance to talk about it, actually was really good. Um, I found it really inspiring. Um, and I think generally this week, work has been a lot better than it has the previous weeks. I swear that the last couple months have been pretty hellish for me. Um, and I just really questioned a lot of, like, my purpose, I suppose. Um, 
but this week things have really turned around I hope for the long term um, and not just momentarily and like I really hope that the inspiration that I feel and the motivation I feel right now lasts um, because I would love to be in a position where I enjoy doing what I do in my day job and I enjoy my side businesses obviously and so I feel like I can actually say I spend my time doing the things I love I hope that's ultimately always been my goal I just want to spend the time I have doing things that I really love and if I can say that with conviction then I feel like my life is going well and I really don't have any complaints or any need to change anything so yeah that's how I feel right now I feel good so I know this vlog is going to be a positive vlog because I honestly feel really positive about everything right now so yeah um, and just um, I guess grateful also that I managed to ha like hang out with some really good friends <laughs> um, even though I'm still a little shaken up from the whole uh, escape room but that's okay because I will watch cat videos tonight or something like bubbly and cheerful and that will hopefully calm me down but yeah don't know if I'm gonna keep vlogging for the entire weekend I might see I, f I always think to myself oh, I'll just vlog a couple days like it just makes the vlog a little bit more interesting than if I was to just vlog a single day and I don't even think I have that much footage to show you guys it's like the longest piece of footage is probably just me sitting here talking to you guys but um the problem is I always forget and then it's like Tuesday and then I remember oh crap I never like actually vlogged after that so I think I will just wrap it up maybe I'll wrap it up here to be honest because I don't think I'm going to do anything else when I get home um when I get home it's pretty much just tidying up my desk and focusing on oh, this is back focusing on doing what did I get? Oh, Shop. I don't know what little shop calls. Little shop things. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Calls, calls it this last time. I'm not surprised at the, at the Colt Express as well. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I'll give this to my niece. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I think I'll sign off the vlog here. Sorry if it's kind of short and there wasn't a lot going on. Um, I don't know. In my mind, I thought maybe I would vlog a conference and then I realized I can't vlog the conference because that would be just like not even from a standpoint of I don't want to involve work in my vlogs, but just for privacy reasons, for like company privacy like reasons. All, all like the people that aren't you? Yeah, not just the people, but like because we were talking about company strategy and stuff like that. Oh, and yeah. I know that I can't reveal that to like other competitors, so I couldn't have vlogged it. I don't know why I thought I could vlog it. So yeah, I'm gonna wrap the vlog now. Thank you so much for watching. This is Selena reporting from Melbourne. Back to the internet.